Yes, sir. We're officially back at it. Boog Nice coming at you with another daily news update. Again, tap it in real quick as the news continues to come. Just want to encourage everybody to go out there and see the Deadpool and Wolverine movie. Me and P did a sort of spoiler free review of the movie on this past Friday's episode of the Articulated Comic Book Art Podcast. Please go back. Check that out. One point that I really tried to drive home is that I do believe that we will get a comic based Cassandra Nova figure at some point now. You know, Grant Morrison's run on New X-Men, which led into Astonishing X-Men, is where Cassandra Nova was introduced. And she did show up briefly in the Astonishing X-Men run, kind of for real, but not for real. I won't spoil it if 30 years later you still haven't read that story, but I would recommend that you check that out. But being as though we are building our Astonishing X-Men Marvel Legends team, we always need to round things out with villains. In terms of the figures from the movie, I'm glad we're going to get Colossus, updated Deadpool from the previous movies, and then the new Deadpool and Wolverine, as well as Wolverine and Street Clothes. It's nice that they update in this uh, Venom Pool builder figure. All of the 50th anniversary Wolverine stuff has been phenomenal. Finally, another Punisher, Bushwhacker. I don't know how I fully feel about this Lockjaw and Crystal 2-pack. I feel like Lockjaw may be a little undersized, and I feel like they really needed to try to top the Mezco version of Lockjaw, and I don't know if they did that here. Finally, Wong and another Doctor Strange. And you know, every day that they have the con, they usually put something out new in the case. I believe this Wolverine was put out today on Sunday. So an updated, what looks to be a pinless Wolverine from the arcade game or inspired by the arcade game. The Destiny and Rogue 2-pack, which is real bare bones in terms of accessories with these two. Definitely feeling the Phoenix figure. Angel is one of my favorite figures from this year as well. I think we are going to be rounding out the first five original X-Men in semi-modern costumes. I talked about this Professor X rounding out the Jim Lee costumed X-Men crew. And in the previous video, I talked about this direct-to-consumer Dragon Man, which is probably one of my favorite things shown off this weekend. When's Giant Man coming out? I'm in the game, I'm grinding, I got to play 24 hours in the day, 7 days out the week, I never sleep I'm on my grizzly bear, 52 weeks out the year, yeah Uh, My mind sharp as my best blade, I'm on my grind 10 years out the decade Uh